Okay, this is a critical video lesson learned here. I had all, everything connected yesterday, all these parts. There's a bunch of connection. We're coming down here. This is half inch. So the connection on this end here looks like this. It's wider. The, the hose wasn't long enough, so I have this connection connecting these two here. Um, it was slightly a mistake. I didn't get this part when I first started because I thought that um, we would just go um, from big to small again, you know? So then I had um, these here. This. I thought it was going to be like this. That's because I didn't know that all, all of these are this big. So anyway, that had to get done. This is just a simple why. This is a garden hose. This is exactly what you'd use outside. And I and he didn't even get new washers. I, I did this for a couple of hours yesterday. I could not get it to, to tighten. I literally went to uh, True Value a second time to maybe get better tape or something. But of course, you don't use tape. When there's a washer, when there's a washer, you don't use tape because tape will maybe make it so that the the threads can't get to the bottom and these threads have to go to the bottom to press against that washer. And Nick said, like, this isn't even super tight. I could turn this, this is hand tight. So it's a question of hand tightening it, not this. I was tightening the shit out of it with this, but thank God I stopped before I broke anything. I said, you know what, this feels wrong. Whenever you use too much force, you probably do something wrong. Um, you know, unless you know that's the reason of the force. So anyway, this is, I think, hand tight. This is on full blast. There's no water dripping. There's no leaking. It looks fantastic. Everything is here good. And and that's that. The other issue to keep note in this video is that I put this splitter in here. I cut this pipe and put all these parts together. Nothing is glued in here because there's no water pressure in there. So we'll see. We may not even need it because this drains down there. There's no back pressure. There's no pressure at all. So just fall into the hole and not leak through um, because in order to leak through, it needs at least a little bit of force telling it to get out. So maybe if it fills up, maybe the weight of the water is enough, but it may, probably isn't. So anyway, that's the video. Here's the lesson learned, the big lesson. Just do it gently. If you tighten it too much is what I was doing. It tightens, tightens, tightens. And now the rubber washer is bunching up. So yeah, freaking perfect.